What's going on today, guys and girls, children of all ages? How are y'all doing today? Big Bill back with some more American Truck Simulator as we are back in the Peterbilt 389. We are back hauling loads in the 389, and we are back. Well, obviously, we are back. Yeah. <laughs> How are y'all doing today? I am doing good. Uh, this is Today is Sunday, September 15th, 2019. And you guys are probably wondering why am I uploading this in the afternoon of Sunday? Well, I just got done record. Oh, I'm actually recording right now, but I'm actually going to be uploading this right as soon as I'm done. <laughs> um, I had no time um, to do any video. I only had time to do it when... I knew my schedule, so so yeah. Um, let's talk about today's trip. Today's trip, we are going to go from Los Angeles, California, all the way up to Medford, Oregon. We're going from Cat to the Xena Forest Products. This is a stumper. Um, obviously, this thing removes all the stumps after they are done cutting. Um, or the, as they're cutting a job, uh, they come in and they cut all the stumps. That way the big machines do not go over them. This thing weighs 39,500 pounds. We're going to get paid $50,000 and $50,125. It's going to be a 15 and a half hour trip, 784 miles. Let's do it. Excuse me. All right, so I'm gonna hop back in the truck here. After doing a little silent run right there for you guys. How y'all doing today? I'm doing good. Hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend, like I am. I'm actually working. Um, yeah, ain't that surprising? Brand new area. I'm going back to my old area, and here we're getting asked to do some overtime. And yeah, I'm back. <laughs> I am a little under the weather. Um, I am going to try to talk as smooth as possible uh, for you guys. Um, I might let the truck do more of the talking today. So, Oh, we're going to take this exit. All right. We'll just take this lane then. <sighs> and as you see by the fuel gauge right there, we can we do need to stop and get some go-go juice, some diesel. Because I am not stopping to have this thing get refilled.
so. But anyways, guys, how are you doing? I am doing good. Obviously, um, obviously you guys can't tell by how long the videos have been. Um, it's been a while. <laughs> Actually, the last upload was earlier, uh, earlier in the week. Um, and, and like I said, guys, it, this is going to take some time to get used to, um, this will take obviously some time now obviously we're going to be resting here um so you know 13 hour trip 10 hours and 29 minutes it took us an hour to get to the from my garage uh to the place to pick this up so me and mike just make a safe bet and stop somewhere to get some sleep and fuel so i mean that's the whole purpose why we had the sleeper so don't be surprised if I make this a two-part video. Um, the two now, if I do make it a two-part, the first part will come out. I mean, the second part will come out later in the week. Um, but we'll let you guys know. I do have a time limit of well, my time limit nowadays for a two-part video would be 30 minutes. So. And I am going to hit the pause here. All right, so haven't done really much change. Haven't really changed anything to the truck. Um, haven't done anything to the garages yet. Um, still have all my other trucks. Still have all my other drivers. But I did make a purchase for a paid mod, and I'm really, I am actually going to show this off to you. I know you guys are Bart modding. I know if you guys are part of the Facebook page, Bart modding. Um, I actually just got a mod from him, and here it is is the livestock trailer and you can actually purchase this one and you can actually set it up however you want it different types of cows different types of livestock to haul but the coolest thing is is this right here check that out big bill trucking in blue and black just like the truck um, that is just um, that is just cool, and I mean, I recommend this mod. I had this mod for, I think the last, um, the last, I think week or so, maybe two weeks. Um, so, pretty cool trailer mod. You can actually buy it. Um, I just wanted to show it off today because this is actually the first time I'm actually been doing. Right here, you go Wilson. And you can do pretty much anything you want to it. So. So yeah, I just want to show off that mod. I um, hope to find a load. Hope to find a load here shortly with it. Um, I do have, I actually did buy it um, in the other profile. So I might do a load over there with it the setup I have I have a bunch of lights on it and I do have it painted a little bit so so yeah just want to show that off I do recommend anything from him his trailer packs are pretty cool Obviously, in the future, I might be getting another one. So. Yeah, I figured. And if you guys are wondering, yes, I am watching some NFL football right now. I'm actually watching the Rams versus Saints. Pretty good matchup, rematch of the last year's NFC Championship. So, come on, CFI.
And if I do feel like I'm rushing this video, I'm actually quite rushing this because I do have to go to work tonight. So, <laughs> I just found it, you know, perfect timing, you know, I just got done eating dinner, I woke up, and... So... My original plan was to do this in the morning, but I just, you know... us here we have nine hours eleven hours we have to really been breaking the speed limit but my goal is to get um, probably to here outside Reading or maybe just play it safe and oh well, actually yeah Go to Reading, sleep outside Reading, that way I can go to Medford. So. Hopefully everything is working, hopefully all the audio, hopefully you guys can hear me, so, <laughs> I hope I fixed that problem, I think it was a little bit easy, so, if you guys are wondering, um, well, <laughs> I know some of you are wondering, uh, when do I plan on uploading a video? of my new vehicle um hopefully later in the week um i might find some time i might um go find an empty spot around here around my town Just show you guys off my new truck um if you guys don't know i did purchase a new vehicle It is a 2016 Chevy Silverado 1500 High Country Crew Cab short box. Um, hope you all can still hear me. Obviously, that thing needs to go away. Um, don't know what it is. I mean, so. So yeah, now, if you guys do remember, my old vehicle was a 2012 Chevy Cruze Eco. Um, I traded that in. Um, I'm not really going to go high into detail about it, but it's a very nice truck. And so... There should be a rest area coming up, shouldn't there be? Or a fuel stop.
the only iffy part I have is Sacramento right now. And if you guys don't know, if you guys ever travel up to five, you would know this intersection right here will bite you in the ass. <laughs> and I mean it. I mean, it really will. So. Uh, but hopefully you all have a hopefully you all had a wonderful weekend. Um I I did. Um I was working but I was actually able to watch some a little bit of college football yesterday and a little bit of the NASCAR Xfinity series race. Um unfortunately today the Monster Energy race in Las Vegas ain't on until seven o'clock, so I pretty much won't be seeing it. Now As uh, the chase, well, the playoffs has officially started. Uh, chase Elliott looks like he's going to do good. Um, I know there's a couple of good drivers in there that are going to be battling the Joe Gibbs guys. I know everybody's picking one of the Joe Gibbs cars to win it all. I mean, who won it? You know, they had the most wins this year. I mean, so... Right now, if I would if I were to pick one that's not Chase Elliott, like who like that's my favorite driver. If I had to pick one that's my my favorite to win, like if I had to pick a nice bet, it would probably be Martin Shrex Jr. And my second one will probably be <sighs> Kurt Busch. Just, 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 you know, I'm just predicting it. I mean, you know, obviously, do I want a Chevy guy to win? Of course. I want Chase Elliott to win or anybody who's in a, Cam a Camaro to win it. Um, it would be nice to see Kyle Larson win it. Maybe Kurt Busch win it. Um, William Byron's in it. Alex Bowman. You know, it would be see, good to see one of them guys win it. So. <laughs> Who do you guys want to win? Let me know. Or if you guys just don't follow NASCAR, period. I know a lot of people that follow my channel, they just watch it for all the videos I make. I do. <laughs> And of course, NFL football has started, and uh, college football, 100 years of NFL seasons, 100 NFL seasons, and 150 years of college football. So... Now, obviously, for college football, I'm a big University of Notre Dame. For NFL, obviously, I'm a New England Patriots fan. And today, the Patriots did beat the Miami Dolphins 43 to nothing. And I honestly, I just got to say this right now. Um, team looks good. Uh, I think our defense is a little better than last year. I think our offense is going to pick up. Um hate to see the fact that we have Antonio Brown, but that's a later discussion. Um, for a guy who got out of the Oakland Raiders like that, you know, that's really not cool. So. It's great to see um, he's willing to try out our team. He's willing to put in the hours. And he's willing to work with Tom Brady. So.
Oh, yeah, we're not, we're not gonna make it. How many miles left do we have earned? 41 gallons, 218 miles of fuel. Wow, they actually stopped. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. Oh man, you try to use this camera view right here, freaking! It's hard to use. I mean, I see people all the time using. They, you know, it's hard. <laughs> man, I just don't want to be in the inside view the whole time. Wow. Holy crap. Are you kidding me? Okay, now, I'm, I'm just saying this now. I mean, in all seriousness. I must be getting lucky. Or something. <laughs> Every time I come up here, on this profile, well, it must be the other profile had bad luck. Yeah, we're gonna have to stop for fuel and we'll just stop for sleep. But once we do that, guys, that will be the end of the video. Um, I do want to get off here and take care of some stuff. As sorry, buddy. As you guys do know, I do not record in the afternoon I mainly record at night or early in the morning so or middle of the day so <laughs> it's just something I just don't do I mean in the afternoon I'm always busy I'm always doing stuff I'm either with family or I'm out or I'm out with friends so I figured that was going to happen. Excuse me. None of these guys are getting called in, so.
Ooh, they, they're getting called in over there. Oh, one did. <laughs> it's always funny watching the AI pull in there. I gotta watch, gotta get off the TV. <laughs> Trying to stay off the gas as much as possible, but we might. We may have to stop, but we're going to have to stop. But I'm just waiting for that light to click on. See, this is what happens when you rush videos. <laughs> Uh, that's just my mistake. And to be honest, I really haven't used the services yet for the refueling, so I want to know how long that would take or how long um, that would be. That's the one thing you don't want to do to these big trucks, just run them out of fuel. Because it will take a while for them to get started. I mean, that's a lot of diesel machinery. I know our one box truck, if you run that thing out of fuel, you gotta do a whole bunch of shit. <laughs> and trust me, it's not fun. Oh man, 12 gallons. I think it said 88 miles. <laughs> oh, man. And the sad part is we are under an hour, but, you know, I'm, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to risk it. Because once this guy starts dozing, he's going to go either way. And I'm not doing that. So I'm going to pull over, get some fuel up here, get some sleep for this dude. And I'll make this a two-part video um, because I do, like I said before, guys, I am sort of rushing this video. So. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. 
we just barely got here. And there we go. Twelve hundred dollars later. Two hundred nineteen two hundred and ninety two gallons. Two hundred and ninety two point forty two gallons of fuel. And we're gonna go park next to his log truck. Turn off the lights, turn off the beacon. Oh, he's got that log trailer I haven't installed. Check out this custom truck. Wow. That must be that uh, tuning truck pack that I have. Alright, let's get some sleep. Alright guys, this is where I'm going to leave the truck. Um, in the next video, uh, we will complete it. I see we have 247 miles left, 4 hours and 42 minutes, but um, that would be almost a whole hour video. I don't really want to do that, so for the first time ever, I have to do a two-part video. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys can still hear me. Hopefully the audio didn't cut out, um, and I hope you all enjoyed it. Sorry if I did feel like I was rushing. Um, like I did say, I do have to go to work tonight, and... Um, this was just a late occurrence that I just had the house to myself and that. But anyways, guys, hope you all enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.